Yes, guys, I'm traveling not to London, Berlin, or the Middle East, or even any other part of Africa. But I'll be going to my hometown, Wajir County. Hi, guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Verdi here. So, the other day, my folks called me and told me, Yes, we'd love for you to travel to Wajir County. It's my mom's hometown, but anyway, it's all our hometown. So, <clears throat> they want me to actually go and unwind because after graduation I decided to stay at home and so they think I'm wasting time wasting time yeah what all parents think about when the kids graduate and they have no jobs but anyway that's my choice this particular video is dedicated to all my friends who've been asking the following questions about Wajir I won't call them weird questions but actually it's because not many people know about the northeastern part of Kenya and I'm using this video to answer such questions. If you think you have a particular question in mind, please go to the comment section and ask and I will be more than willing to answer your question. Let's get started. One of the very first questions my friends have been asking me is, is there network in Wajir? Is there going to be internet in Wajir? Are you going to be able to browse and do all that? And I guess my answer is yes. Yes, there's plenty of network, if that's what you want me to say. There's plenty of network in Wajir town, but I'm not sure of the current status of other areas of Wajir, especially outside town. So yes, there is network. The second most important question that my friends have been asking me is, how safe is Wajir? Actually, if you check the current status of Wajir, Wajir is called a safe haven for northeastern part of Kenya. When? Because there have been a lot of skirmishes in Garissa, and also Mandera is not that safe currently because of the insecurities that has been going on for the longest time ever. And if you're a Kenyan, you know what has been going on in the news for the past two weeks in Mandera County. And also the same is for Garissa. So most Somalis and most people who live in northeastern part of Kenya, especially the Somalis, because it's the Somalis who populate that place, say that Wajir is a safe haven for them. So yes, that's how Wajir is safe. There have been no skirmishes, alhamdulillah, and yeah, I think I'd probably say that Wajir is one of those places in the northeastern part that is safe. This is funny because everyone thinks when you go to your hometown, you're going to stay with your grandma or your gukas and shushus. But I'll be staying with my uncle who happens to be a head teacher in one of Wajir's secondary schools in the town area. So yeah, I'll be staying with my uncle. So guys, I'm being asked what's your plan when you get to Wajir. Um, actually, I don't have any plans, but you know, I'm a trained journalist and uh, the best i can do is just do a reke reke is also known as location scouting when i get there so that will help me to know if i can do stories from that particular place and also a bit of vlogging i hope to do a lot of vlogging when i get to a gym so yeah i actually currently i don't have like big plans when i get to a gym but yeah that's my current plan to get there do location scouting and then know what kind of stories to collect and what not. It's the last question I think I'll answer because if I start talking about all the questions my friends have been asking me, there are too much questions. So the last question will be, how long are you gonna be in Wajir County? Guys, I don't know. You know, it's not like it's work stuff that I can say um, I'm going to work there for two weeks or it's not just like something I planned on my own. So I don't know how long I'll be there, but um, I'll let you know, I'll let you know when I get there. I hope it's gonna be a good trip ride, guys. Right. So guys, that's all I have for you on today's video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if you like it. If you don't like it, guys, please just give it a thumbs up. You can also go to the comment section and ask me some questions you have about Wajir County and I'll be more than willing, like I said in the starting of this video, that I will be more than willing to answer your questions and see you in my next video.